you want to do is you want to power it on and of course it depends on your laptop your HP laptop will have a power on a different place you're going to tap F11 that's F as in Frank 11 multiple times and sometimes it might take two or three times for it to catch you might have to repower it down and do it again and you should get like a little circle there as you see okay so that one actually did not work let's try it again whoops and you could also hold it down too okay let's try it again Power it on. Now, when it says please wait, that usually means it's catching. So if you ever see that, that's a good sign. Because what that's doing is basically it's taking you back to uh, factory restore for computer repair. And that just goes to show you that that took like three times for it to finally catch. All right, looks like Windows didn't load correctly. That's okay. What you want to do is go see Advanced Repair Options, and this is the screen you're going to want to get to. That's the screen I was trying to get to by hitting F8. So, what you want to do? Uh, this is actually a Windows 10 machine, by the way. So, you're going to want to click Troubleshoot, and you're going to choose Reset This PC. lets you choose to keep or remove your files and then reinstalls Windows. That's what we want. Now you can either keep your files or remove everything. I sort of highly recommend you go on ahead and remove everything and just put it back to factory um, because there can be some problems in translation when you do that. If there's a virus or whatever you're going to end up saving your virus so you don't want that. So remove everything. and let's do the thing now reset this PC this particular computer already has Windows uh, 365 I don't know if it looks like it's a one-year um, subscription now it says reset this PC. Do you want to fully clean your drive? When you remove your files, you can also clean the drive so that the files can't be recovered easily. This is more secure, but it takes much longer. Um, so just remove my files. Use this if you're keeping your PC. Or fully clean the drive. Use this if you're going to recycle the PC. This can take several hours. So basically, if you're going to maybe resell it to somebody or you don't want someone to possibly have access to your history or anything like that you might want to go ahead and fully do that the fully clean the drive which will take like a few hours but being that we're keeping this PC we'll just say remove my files and then reset and this should usually take about 30 minutes And that's it. You see here we're at 1% and of course we'll go to 100. Thank you for watching.